So guys, today in this video, I'm going to describe a scam that is happening very rapidly in many countries. So make sure you watch it till the end and share with as many people you can in order to save innocent people. So guys, um, after COVID, uh, these scams have increased because a lot of things have gone online. So if you see before COVID, a lot of visa processes were manual. Nowadays, a lot are actually online. And with the e-visa, with even countries like India offering, many other countries are offering, it's very easy to apply online and get it. But there is a catch. You need to apply it legitimately. I mean, on the legitimate website. A lot of websites have popped up that do offer you e-visa for many countries, even uh, to the countries that don't offer e-visa. And people get into those traps by sharing their confidential personal information and paying money. A lot of fake agents are also using this technique because earlier there was some scope to verify like if you have to go to the embassy and uh, get things uh, stamped and all. It was something that if you have done something wrong or if something is not correct, it will be identified there. But now it's like very, uh, what do you call, very difficult. Uh, not difficult, I mean, people are making use of this technique. They issue you something online. They say, yeah, this is an e-visa. Take a printout <clears throat> and go board your flight. And when they reach the airport, they find no, they have been cheated. So this is hap happening uh, and it is increasing rapidly. So make sure you don't fall into the trap. If you're applying e-visa for a country, first of all, find out if that country really issues an e-visa. And then find out like uh, once the visa is issued, like uh, find out like if it is legitimate or not. If you're applying on your own, then it's very easy to check because you know where you have applied for. But if you're not doing it on your own, then uh, be careful on which site you are doing make sure you go to the legitimate site only and not to any uh, illegitimate site because then there could be a problem so that's how it works guys let me know what you feel about it thanks for watching please subscribe to the channel